For the past two decades, Walfrey Lopez lived in the dark. I was around uh, 21 years old when I started to lose my vision. He was diagnosed with retinitis pigmentosa, a degenerative eye disease. His son, now 21, was just two years old at the time. His daughter, whom he's never seen, is now 12. While doctors told Lopez and his family there's nothing they could do, they never gave up hope. Today, you're going to experience, or I hope you experience, flashing lights. Lopez is the first patient at the University of Florida Health Shands Hospital in Gainesville to get the bionic eye. A complex surgery by ophthalmologist Gibran Horsheed, a computer chip implanted in the back of the eye, interacts with electrodes placed on the eye's surface, making artificial vision possible with special glasses. The special glasses, they have a small high-definition camera which captures the images. It's not vision as Lopez used to know it, but it allows him to see shapes and contrasting images. We are giving you a seventh sense, and then we teach you how to use it as a vision. After 20-something years, I'm really excited. Tears of joy. Last night I couldn't sleep because I said, wow, it's the first day that whatever he can see at least something about me. A life-changing procedure. I'm Marty Salt reporting.